I'm Dominic Giratano. Welcome back to BCTD Now, the news video of the building trades for the week of August 22nd. Last Thursday, the Tennessee Valley Authority unanimously voted to finish construction of a nuclear reactor in Hollywood, Alabama. Bellafont Unit 1, a project which stalled at around 80% completion nearly 35 years ago due to cutbacks, is getting a second life. Only about half of the site is still up to code. Mechanical upgrades and finishing will result in the creation of thousands of union construction jobs beginning in early 2013. That's after Watts Bar Unit 2, the reactor there, has its fuel loaded. As an aside, construction at Watts Bar Unit 2 is already employing about 1,100 BCTD members. TVA operates in seven southern states and directly impacts the employment of more than 10,000 construction, modification, and maintenance jobs. They have a long history of working closely with the building trades. They believe in project labor agreements and see the value that today's craftsmen and women bring to the table. Helmets to Hard Hats is still serving and had a major victory last week. A new project labor agreement was ratified between the Chattanooga, Tennessee Building Trades Council and Wallbridge, one of America's top construction firms, which included H2H language. Under the agreement, the Center for Military Recruitment, Assessment, and veterans' employment will be heavily involved and will work in tandem with H2H to help place members of the National Guard and Reserves into the building trades. They'll be going to work for Wallbridge and its partnering subcontractors at Arnold Air Force Base on the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers Turbine Engine Dry Air Capability Design Build Repairs. The Building Trades Department encourages all state and local councils to include the H2H provision in all future PLAs negotiated in your home areas. Thanks for your time this week. Remember, the Building Trades Department is always on. Find us on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. And if you're away from your laptop or computer and can't access the BCTD content, not to worry anymore. All news and video content on BCTD.org is now mobile, so when you're on the go, you can still connect. Just log on as you normally would and keep in touch with the latest union news and information. See you next week.